This bombshell beauty right here can ride like a wind. She got one more to go. In the hey guys, welcome to Barrel Racer Life. My name is Maddie Stoltman. Uh, this week has kind of been the river show. Um, she was the one that got to go to the last couple barrel races and I'm really excited with how things are working with us. Um, I kind of had a little mentality change with that horse. Um, after the few races in Moses Lake where things did not go so good, um, we had a couple okay runs, but they weren't that great. And then the bad ones were really bad. <laughs> so I had a bit of mentality change. I actually contacted, some of you are going to laugh at me, a um, equine animal communicator and she was really helpful and I just realized like with that I have to be patient um, I can't decide that this horse needs to be ready uh, she has to be on her own time so I think she needs a little bit more time going slow and that was sort of um, confirmed for me I guess through this reading again some of you are gonna think I'm nuts but I don't care uh, so we did that this last week we've been slowing it down and she did awesome I'm really really happy with her so I'll show you guys about those races and about some things going on at home and uh, that's about all I got for you so here we go wild hair as usual. Um, I've got River in the trailer. We're headed to Barrel Club. Um, so I think it's so cool that there's a barrel racing club. Um, that was non-existent where I grew up. So um, we are going to Barrel Club. I'm just taking River tonight. We're gonna go make a nice uh, slow smooth run. So I kind of get the feeling we need to just back it off a little bit. <laughs> Um, it's not like we were going super fast, but obviously I was putting too much pressure on her and she wasn't ready. So, um, the nice thing about barrel club races, they're not super expensive and it's really close. So we're going to head there tonight and, uh, go smooth things out a little bit. Today, I'm gonna to try and stay two-handed at the second barrel and I thought if I'm going a little slower I could probably do that without falling off <laughs> and it did stay two-handed and that was really good and she came right around the second barrel beautifully I am so 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 happy she did awesome she got lots of treats so we're just gonna keep going slow for a little bit I think it's me worth it riding in the rain. Hey, Tita. Yeah, it's not the nicest day today, but we got to get it in shape. And Mr. Passport over there is getting hand walked, so I've just been ponying him on Jado when we do our walks. Right, miss? We're a little snorty today. All right, last one. I'm on Claude now. So almost done and I think the rain's gonna quit as soon as I'm done, so isn't that always how it goes? She don't care that it's raining. Off we go. Going down to barrel race today. Um, I'm gonna do the same thing with River again. I'm just taking her. Um, 
and it's like a very different arena than we were in the other day so this is a very big outdoor so it will be a little more difficult to keep things controlled but I think we can do it and my sidekick with muddy paws good thing we have a seat cover Find the treats. <laughs> All right, all done at the Barrel Race River. Did really good. Um, I was just going out for a smooth, correct run, and we did that. Um, I felt in control, which it is a really big arena here, so um, I was kind of anticipating that she'd maybe want to run a little harder, and she actually did really good. She was totally fine with loping through and did awesome. So. No complaints from me. Um, I'm really happy with that. I wanted to try and stay two-handed and really be able to direct her around her turns and she just did awesome. So I'm really happy with that. I feel like we're making progress. We're just gonna need to do that for a little while and uh, get a little more confidence and then we'll be good to go. getting ready to head to Idaho this weekend so Claude is making a comeback this is gonna be his first race back in I don't know since maybe January um, I don't maybe February I don't remember the last time I ran him but it has definitely been a while and I have really missed running him um, so I've been legging him back up for the last probably month or so um, and we are gonna be making a comeback this weekend we're headed to Nampa Idaho um, I'm gonna run Claude in the open and then I'm taking hot sauce and he's gonna run in the futurity um, everybody else is staying home this weekend a river is I'm just gonna keep going to the small jackpots with kind of not so high of an entry fee for a little while and just get things worked out um, but I'm looking forward to taking my boys over to Idaho we're gonna pick up my friend Rachel and her paternity colt along the way uh, it's gonna be a really fun weekend the facility there is unbelievable the facility like facility itself is beautiful the stalls are nice uh, they've really cool wash racks and everything in the arena is amazing and the dirt's good like it's just a great place to go so I'm really looking forward to it there's lots of money lots of prizes it should be a good time so you guys, as always, I very much appreciate you watching. And if you're enjoying these videos, please subscribe to my channel.